Dark as a Shadow by Lawrence F. Lowry. This book is about light and shadows. Today as we read, we will look for ways to create shadows as well as how shadows can change and move. On the street or in the park, a shadow is flat. A shadow is dark. You may see shadows in the daytime. You may see shadows in the night. Shadows can fall any time at all, but no shadow falls without light. Shadows are cast by all kinds of things, by objects like boxes and toys. Plants and animals can cast shadows too. So can girls and boys. A puppy can make a shadow. So can a hamster, a chicken, or cat. Flowers and leaves make shadows too. Have you ever seen shadows like that? You won't see a shadow without a source of light, from the sun, from the lamp, or from the moon at night. You can see shadows when light is shining. Can you see them in the dark? Shadows have different shapes. Shadows have different sizes. A small round object like a ball makes a round shadow on a wall. Can you match an object with its shadow? Which shadow shape was made by an ape? Which shadow shape was made by a boat? Which shadow shape was made by a goat? An object will cast a shadow when it comes between light and a door. An object will also cast a shadow when it comes between light and a floor. An object will make a shadow if it comes between light and a screen. A shadow needs something to fall on, a light and an object between. If you do not move an object and do not move the light, a shadow will not move morning, noon, or night. But if you move the object or if you move the light, the shadow will move and change and grow. Why does this happen? Do you know? You can have a shadow in the morning. You can have a shadow at night. You can have a shadow any time of the day, but you can't have one without light. Look at your shadow. Is it always dark and flat? Look at the darkest part of your shadow. Do you know a place darker than that? When you twist and bend or wiggle and shake, what kinds of shadows can you make? A turning, twisting object has a shadow that will change. Don't you think that turning shadows can be just a little strange? If you turn on lights in two places, two shadows will fall. One may be big, one may be small but you will still see two shadows on the wall. A shadow is fun for the games we can play. A shadow is fun to watch during the day. A shadow is long in the morning at 10. It grows shorter at noon and then longer again. Late in the afternoon, long shadows fall. And before the sun sets, they are longest of all.
shadows are fun to make too. With one hand, you can make a dog shadow or you can make a rabbit-like shadow with two. A shadow always seems to be under your feet, but it never gets in your way. If someone asked, what is a shadow made of? What, if anything, would you say? In the daytime, you see shadows by sunlight, and at night by the light of the moon. You see shadows by the light of fire. You see shadows by the light in your room. Dark is a shadow, bright is a light. The world's biggest shadow is something called night.